Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, the beer review guy. Beer review guy reviewing a wine. So this is um, called the uh, Winking Owl. Um, I was in my one of my local uh, um, <clears throat> liquor stores, and uh, Danielle that uh, works there. Hi, Danielle. She told me about this new um, wine line that's coming out. Uh, there was like I think there was like six different flavors there. Um, this was one of them. This was the grape wine with natural flavors. This is the sweet red. Um, as you can see here, the, the owl is winking. Um, let's see. Taste is sweet. Style is medium bodied. Notes, it says blackberry and raspberry flavors with the, with the velvety soft finish. Uh, food pairings are bar barbecue, beef, ribs, and spicy fajitas. Temperature is best when served chilled, and it's cold right now. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Contains sulfides vented and bottled by Winking Owl, Vi Winking Owl Vineyards, Modesto, California. Refrigerate after opening. I will. Okay. <clears throat> It is a 8% ABV. She said that they're trying this. They can't remember how she said it. They're trying this this and see how it goes there. They weren't necessarily going to make it a, a regular <clears throat> a regular thing, I don't think. But if it does well, I think they're going to maybe keep ordering it. So, uh, let's see. Let's see what we got. And this was like three sixty-five. Very, very cheap. Very, very cheap wine. Um, <clears throat> but just you know, eight percent ABV. I mean, and it and if it tastes good, that's that's cool with me. You know, uh, <clears throat> it's cork. It's got one of those. It's not cork, it's uh, another kind. <clears throat> Can't remember what John calls it. At um, Hillbilly Wine 101. Okay, that should be good enough. <clears throat> okay, that's pretty cool. I can get it off. I have to use my pliers. I can get it. We just got through eating dinner, but before that, finishing up the sale. Our, we had our yard sale today. That's pretty cool. Winking Owl Vineyards. They'll probably all say the same thing. This doesn't say sweet red on it. Okay. Let's see what a three dollar and sixty five cent wine tastes like. Well, it has a, has a nice color. It kind of looks like a maybe a weak grape juice. Maybe it has that um, Concord grape. Maybe a little bit on the aroma. Getting a nice. Uh, yeah, just getting a nice grapey, and I'm getting, I think he said raspberry too. Yeah, I'm getting some raspberry. Wait a minute. Blackberry and raspberry flavors. Mm-hmm, okay. 
but not grape. It kind of smells grapey though to me. It smells really good. Getting the alcohol just a little bit. Okay, well, let's see what we got. Wow. That's a very, very nice tasting wine. Just a, it's one of those type of wines that can, it, it would go good with anything, pretty much, I would think. Um, yeah, it has a nice medium sweetness. I'm getting the, the blackberry, I'm getting a little bit of the raspberry. Um, the alcohol is, I'm getting it just a little bit. Yeah, I can see where where they're calling this a medium, they call it medium body, medium bodied. Um, I think if a beer was this type of medium body, we'd more call it light bodied, but maybe it's different with wine. I don't know. <clears throat> very good, very good. Um, very, very little dryness. Just kind of a grape skin dryness on the back end. Not very much. Nice and sweet up front. Hangs around. Right to the finish. Very nice. Um, yeah. I mean, you could drink this just right out. Right out of the bottle. But... <clears throat> Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, very nice. Okay. I mean, for a cheap wine, that's pretty nice. Pretty nice stuff. All right, well, I'm going to end it there. I thank you all for watching. Appreciate it. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye.